Milena Scantlin here. Welcome to Variety's This Week in Comedy, where we bring you the biggest news in comedy covering movies, TV, and the web. Kevin Hart is teaming up with LeBron James for his next movie. That's right, the two will reportedly star in a basketball comedy as a pair of super competitive brothers. Yeah, we said brothers. It's a hilarious concept considering their significant height difference. I mean, of course we've seen something like this before. You remember in 1988 when Arnold Schwarzenegger and Danny DeVito paired up for the comedy Twins. Julius. What? What are you, are you allergic to something? This would mark James's feature film debut and really his first ever acting role. I guess he's been too busy winning championships to focus on a movie career. Anyway, the duo will reportedly start filming the project titled Ballers next summer. The Coen brothers have been getting rave reviews for their latest musical drama Inside Lewin Davis. So maybe it should come as no surprise that the directing duo is planning on another music-centric film this time, though, in the comedy genre. Ethan and Joel revealed the plans during a chat with Vulture.com, and the only other detail they were willing to give up was that it would take place in the world of opera. Oh, hello. I've heard your music. Oh, and there wouldn't be any cats. They told Vulture, In Inside Lewin Davis, we wrote that there was a cat in all of these different scenes, and then we got on the set and had to do it, and you know cats are a pain in the ass. There's nothing fun about it. Every time he'd play a C major, he'd puke a hairball. Family Guy shocked fans everywhere when they decided to kill off an important member of the Griffin family during its November 24th episode. Ryan, look out! But since then, rumors have been swirling that this won't be the last we've seen of the beloved pooch. According to reports, Brian will reemerge in the December 15th Christmas episode. Damn it, Brian, you can't die. We were going to do so many things together. We were going to become windsurfers. I was going to be a little better than you, but we were both going to be good. This is made even more believable considering the episode's official description, which reads, Stewie devises a master plan to get the one and only thing he wants for Christmas. We're hoping that one thing is Brian aren't you guys? Now, as far as how Brian will be resurrected is still unknown. Family Guy bosses have been hush-hush on any of these rumors and even put salt in the wound when they officially replaced Brian with the new Griffin family pet, Vinny, in the opening credits last week. That's cold. We're all gonna miss him very much. Damn it, Ortiz, stop swinging at junk. So for those of you who weren't excited enough about Nathan Fillion's appearance in the upcoming Community Season 5, then here's a little something for your viewing pleasure. While we're not so sure exactly what the Castle Star is doing, we do know that he'll be playing Bob Waite, Greendale's politically savvy custodian, who will face off against Allison Brie's character. Blee, 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 blee. Of course, it's all love when the cameras aren't rolling, with Bree previously sharing these pics of the castle star engaging in some on-set antics with the cast. Community Season 5 is set to premiere with back-to-back -back episodes on January 2nd on NBC. Oh, was it? It's pretty much fact that Bill Murray could show up anywhere at any time. I mean, look, from joining kickball games to crashing karaoke parties to photobombing crying babies. Well, the veteran comedian did it again when he surprised soldiers at a Hawaii military base during their tree lighting ceremony. Murray was joined by Emma Stone when he addressed the crowd. We do a lot of kidding about our tax dollars at work, but I think we're getting real value on this speech right here. I really do. The two stars are currently in Hawaii filming an untitled Cameron Crowe project set to hit theaters sometime next year. Please leave your shoes at the door and good luck on the candy thing. Thanks for watching Variety's This Week in Comedy on Official Comedy. Be sure to click subscribe for all the must-see comedy moments from the world of TV movies and the web.